Hello everyone, myself I am Jay Sagaya Punita. I am the team leader for this project and my team members are Madhimitta, Tarani and Ramalingam. We are from Gojan School of Business and Technology in Chennai. We done a project named Web Fishing Detection which is under the domain of Applied Data Science. Now let's see the introductions of our project. Web phishing is one of the many security threats to web service on the internet. We are using a data set and we are doing data pre-processing and we are doing the train set and the test set using ML algorithm and we are evaluating our model. By evaluating our model, we are getting our input and as a URL to the user. Let's see our description of our project. This is our readme file which we have uploaded in our github. Here we shown technical architecture and our final output snapshot. Now let's see our project report. These are all our project contents. In our project report, our actual task is that we predict the website which is either a safe website or an unsafe website. In our purpose is that we have designed a phishing website which is one of the social attack which steal our user sensitive details such as our user password, credit card detail etc. Using problem nowadays a many fake websites are created in order to steal our sensitive information for illegal purpose. Problem statement is that while using a website it takes some time to load the content plus the details get hacked since hacker will hack the details of the user. The map canvas it is a simple way to capture our user situations of what they think, what they hear, what they see and what they do along with some pain and gains of the project. Followed by ideation and brainstorming in our purpose resolution. We have an alert box which gets hour of the user in order to avoid using a fake website. Followed by problem solution fit then comes the requirement analysis like uh, functional requirement and non-functional requirement. Then we have our project designs with data flow diagrams and architectures of our project. Then comes the user stories in that we specify the types of user. In our project spring scheduling along with our Jira files, we shows the various process chart of the project. Then followed by coding and solutioning and also the testing our project cases. After testing our cases, we comes to performance matrix, then our advantage or disadvantage, then our conclusions followed by future scope, then our source codes are used for our project and also we have attached our IBM cloud deployment snapshot. Let's see the coding part in a spider. This is the project folder section. For the backend process, we created the two Python file. One is app.py and another one is input script.py. Then we created the CSV file, which is nothing but a data set. Input script.py, this is another Python file. This is the entire coding of the input script.py. Here two CSS files are created to give the style for the web page.
one is style dot css and another one is style one dot css and also that we created two html page for creating the web page one is final dot html and another one is index dot html here html and css are used for the front end process now let us see our ibm cloud deployment in our ibm cloud deployment we have uploaded our data set website as our main as our main model for deployment using our api key we have generated our model in that model we have also generated our space id and also we have done um, our logistic regression model as our regression model and also we have done and also we have done our end our scoring endpoint with the ibm cloud and also we done integrated with the flask model on the ibm cloud This is our project structure. Now let's start running our app.py. First, we opening command prompt and we we are typing py space app.py and click on enter. By clicking on enter, click on the HTTP link or copy and paste the any default browser to enter above and after the site is came for solution to detect phishing website. to click on get started button in the home page now open another site of phishing website detection using machine learning to click below the box to enter the that any url for full diction first i will give one step website and click to enter now the site is loading this came your or save This is a legitimate website. The site is loading. The you are safe. This is a legitimate website. Now I enter the another website for wrong URL. I I enter the wrong URL in the above box. I then to I click predict. Now the web page site is loading. To a to go on down the wrong side, we caution. Command prompt is the back end running process for to detect whether this website was safe or not safe for given data set to predict. That's all about our project explanation and demonstration video. Thank you all.